London under fire, when the Luftwaffe rained death and destruction from the sky, and its citizens at this year's Lord Mayor's show had their chance to offer their thanks to civil defence, the central theme. No less a part in London's protection was played by the ACAC gunners, a role now taken over by the Territorial Army with its new and up-to-date equipment. Yes, what debts we owe to civil defence. The ARP wardens, the heavy rescue squads, in fact all who placed the safety of civilians before their own personal welfare. Old memories are revived as the procession passes the blitzed area around St Paul's, recalling the great city fires of 1940 and 41. A place is found for the auxiliary fire service, the heroic brigade who fought the flames until they dropped from sheer exhaustion. And of course the police are there, from the old Bow Street runners to the modern Bobby, who played his part so well in wartime, and of whom in peacetime visiting celebrities still say, aren't they wonderful? The band of the Women's Royal Air Force represented the women's services. Another defender of London in wartime, a tableau depicting the gallant few who did so much. Malta, the courageous George Cross Island, suffered as well as Britain from the bomber's might and offers its contribution to the show with the theme Carnival in Malta, bringing the gaiety of Mediterranean skies to a drab November day in the city of London. ring out as the new Lord Mayor, Alderman Lawson, the youngest for four centuries, is acclaimed by London. So, tableau after tableau hammers home the need for recruits for all the civil defence services. Peace has indeed been dearly bought in two world wars. Let us work to keep that peace now, and in so doing, we shall remember them.